Well, I aged about 20 years in that last two minutes tonight, that's for sure. Uh, but all in all, it's a great league win. You know, we, uh, I think, took a terrific shot from Elon. I mean, they couldn't have played much better. Um, I was really pleased the way we came out in the second half, defended a lot better, uh, did a much better job running our offense. And uh, really, the last 30 minutes of the ball game, we were pretty doggone good, except for the last minute and a half. Uh, we, you know, we, we, certainly, we certainly tried to give it away down the stretch. <clears throat> you come in on, like you said, very strong, and Sam Hannah's looking like Steph Curry or something. Um, he had been cold of late, but you know he's a shooter. Right? Yeah, yeah, we, we know that. He's, I think he's shooting 28% on the season, but that's what he does really well. And the disappointing thing, Dave, quite honestly, is that our number one priority defensively is to defend the three. And if I'm not mistaken, Santa Ana made five or six threes in the first half and never dribbled the ball, which means we clearly aren't paying attention to what we're asked to do. You know, get in his chest, no threes, make him drive the basketball. So that's something we've got to get better at, you know, is taking our scouting report to the game. Um, we struggle with that sometimes, as we seem to struggle a little bit mentally down the stretch. But, uh, you know, again, there's something good going on when you we can – see so many things go against you at times, partially our fault now, but find a way to win a league game. You seem like you guys did a much better job on in the uh, second half. Yeah, there were three of 12. No. Mm -hmm. But anyway, you did a lot better job. We, we, we played a much better second half across the board. You know, ironically, the zone helped us. We played a good bit of zone in the second half, and a team that shoots it that well, you normally don't think play zone against, but we felt we had to do something to disrupt their flow a little bit, you know, and so we mixed in man and zone and had some success with that. Uh, again, we played a great second half until, you know, the last minute and a half, and uh, I think we had five turnovers. We, we, we had the ball in the guy's hands. We wanted him. Now, give, give Elon credit for coming back to where they did, clawing and fighting and diving on the floor for loose balls and, and – uh, um, we have, we have to show more poise down the stretch, that's for sure. Almost seemed symbolic when you had the turnovers, you had uh, two minutes, three throws, and then Daniel sealed the game because he was so, again, so terrific. Yeah, you know, great free throws down in, at the end there. I think Daniel probably had two or three of those turnovers, though. So, uh, you know, it's, it's uh, some, some gr obviously a great game for Daniel. I'm, I'm being very picky, but, you know, we, we got the ball to him earlier to get him to the foul line, and uh, he threw it away two or three different times. So we lost our poise a little bit. I, again, I'll give Elon a lot of credit for that. You talked out of the thousand, over a thousand points this game. Do you have anything to say about that or mention about that? Uh, you know, I'm proud of Daniel. He's had a great career here. I mean, when you, when you talk about Daniel and Omar, you know, two seniors that have never won fewer than 20 games at William Mary, it's a pretty, pretty awesome thing to, to feel like. And uh, he's playing at a high level right now after a very slow start to the year. Uh, and uh, playing at an extremely high level right now. Really proud of him. Also had eight rebounds, I believe. Yeah, I've, sa I've said that several times to different people, but, you know, we put Daniel on the, on the bench for three games. Uh, he wasn't playing at a high level, and that's not the important point, but how he responded to it is the important point. He's really come out and played at a high level. It's not just shooting the ball. It's his overall play. You know, we put him on – tried to keep him on Santa Ana more the second half, he was in foul trouble early, and we didn't want him, you know, guarding him. Uh, but he did a much better job defensively. The rebounds, as you mentioned, uh, he, he's driving the ball so much better than he has at some points during his career. So he's, a, he's been a very complete player lately. That was a key stretch of the game. He got the was tied. And I don't have it exactly in front of me, but I think you outscored him something like 9-4. Yeah. While he was on the bench. That was important for us. It really was. And I thought uh, – uh, you know, Justin Pierce came off the bench and gave us some minutes. Paul Rowley gave us some really good minutes down the stretch. Uh, so those guys were real key for our, our win tonight.